Tefe, I want to punch you in your freaking face. All right, we're okay. Ow, what? Ow, okay, Archer, ow, so freaking, yeah, good start, good start. Uh, I'm assuming other people had to use the hard pass term, right? I haven't watched any videos. 20 targets within 90 seconds. Okay, hard pass term, go. Oh, no, not a good start. Does this not work? Does the hard pass term not work? Oh, no. Oh, no. The hard pass one doesn't work. No. Just like if I step as far out here as possible. Oh, okay. Where's the actual boundary? It's okay. It's slightly over the edge. Okay. I, I, I don't. I don't see a way to do that, right? Because like, all right, let's drop the burst. Oh, and then that triggered me to go out. Okay. I don't have any character that can do projectiles. Um, the only characters that have theoretical range to potentially hit might be, you know, Rosaria's burst and, and, and John Ling's burst, but there's 20 targets we have to hit, and we have to not hit the red targets, right? Like, I don't see any way this is possible. If this was possible to hard past him, I would absolutely just do it. But I, it doesn't, I, I was definitely hitting it at multiple times before. That was, that was a miss. Yeah, like that, I feel like should have triggered it. Oh, and the lightning just triggered it. <laughs> like, like, theoretically, if the lightning lands 20 times in the right spot within 190 seconds, or, or, or a minute and a half, 90 seconds, I think. <laughs> Are the animal catching Pokeballs? Oh, no. Is that what does it? Use Constructs. Albedo and Traveler? Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, the, the burst doesn't help me at all. With... He placed them before he started the challenge. Okay, so... How is... Hmm. Yeah, so obviously I can't use Geo Traveler Constructs. It's the same as just using a bow character functionally. Um, the only thing I could theoretically do is Guova... But I can only place one Guoba, right? And Guoba's not gonna one, I don't think he lasts long enough. Two, Guoba like theoretically could reach at maximum the stuff in one of these. What Guoba don't oh, that's bad, but also like ready? Uh, yeah, 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 I'm ready. Let me let me go. And Guoba already despawned. Yeah, cool, okay. Well, I'll try this. I'll try this again. But Globa, talk to the dude. No, Globa despawned like the moment it started. God dang it. See if you can somehow glitch out of the box and walk. <laughs> That's fair. Um, so, the main way I know. Oh, I didn't even realize I walked out there. The main way I know of like going out of boundaries for anything in this game is by like just locking out um, when you're like past the boundary. Like the game has like a slight grace period where it doesn't trigger boundaries sometimes. And then I am going to Alt F4. I had to relaunch the game. Oh, okay, well that, that's, hmm. So does it do that? All right, let me, does it still do that? Uh, so I gotta go black again. Oh, oh, God. Okay. Stupid lightning. Okay, I'm not going to log out. I'm going to try again. You little troll laughing. <laughs> you got struck by lightning. <laughs> I need medical assistance, not your chuckles. Yep, as soon as I logged in, even though I was within the border, it kicked me out. Okay. So that's not a solution. I use the enemy to try to hit them. She triggers over here. Does she come this far over? Where where is her boundary? Is the question, right? Cause she she spawns like all the way down there. I feel like her boundary point is pretty close to here. Now, okay, well she came closer, so I would need to stand like like I don't know. She would need to reach out, out. 
theoretically, maybe? But the question is, does she stay? So, no. Oh, yeah, you can't even trigger this. So, that's, that's, yeah. There's no way, then. You can't activate him when, when you're in combat, so. Alright, so Toma's Burst. And there's something specific I have to do with Toma's Burst that I don't understand with this Burst. Oh my god, come on, I didn't even step over the edge this time, you freaking jerk. I want to murder you. Like, this, I, I'm fine with trying this over and over, you just need to stop laughing at me every time. Yeah, yeah, I, why, why is this... Why is it so hard to click? Really? Come on. Like, I like how the lightning specifically trolled me and targeted the red one, too. Like, every time the lightning has struck those, it's hit the freaking red one. Theoretically, if I let the game run for about a hundred years on a macro that constantly just started this over, the lightning might eventually solve it for me. Yeah, it doesn't seem to have the range. Tepe does die. Oh, is Tepe the one that gets the delusion? He deserves... <laughs> he deserves it if that's the case. If Tepe is the, the one that turns old because of the delusion, he absolutely deserves it. He just finished Stranger Things, so he came here for good vibes. Well, the good vibes are that I want to kill Tepe. Hey, Lightning actually did something for me. Alright, well... <laughs> only 19 more to go. Come on, Lightning. Come on, Lightning. I believe in you. I wish this was like Breath of the Wild where you can like leave metal objects in the ground. Right, that would be so fun if you could like leave metal on the ground and then it would just strike in the particular locations, but instead it's just, oh, come on. If we get like two more strikes, that'd be like seven strikes total. So each strike has to hit like an average of three, but, and I'm assuming as time goes on, we have more blue targets grouped together. So theoretically, Theoretically. Oh, 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 see, it actually hit it, but it also hit the red one, so, you know. I, I was mostly joking about the lightning. The lightning is just stupid. We're not gonna, we're not gonna try to get a, a, literally perfect lightning strikes to hit. Yeah, go figure, Toma. You're the one that got struck by lightning five times. Yeah, I don't think this pot does anything for attracting lightning. By placing it on the spot the dummy will spawn on. Well, even then, right? They even then we're still. Oops, I didn't mean to go on the T bot. Uh, even if it does break it by being on the spawn point of the dummy, that's one dummy. <laughs> it's one. All right, we'll try the. Ow, ow, what? It's like the fourth time I've been hit by lightning. I'm sure you'll get it. I'm sure you'll get it this time. Screw. You. Basically, just stay in the box. Yeah. Oh, I see. There's a little, like, wave of fire. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think that goes near far enough. No, it's like halfway it needs to go. Yeah, it doesn't reach anywhere near far enough. Okay, I didn't know that was even a thing. I never noticed that before. <laughs> so. Shush, 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 shush. Okay. Uh, we'll try Xiangling here, but the, the problem with Xiangling is even if we can theoretically like manage to perfectly curve it so that right it because it, right it's gonna like here let me bring the mouse here it's gonna like swing around you right so the pyronado is gonna like swing like this so I have to duration's <sighs> ten seconds like I had to hit twenty in ten seconds perfect oh freaking <laughs> One. And not get hit by lightning in the 10 seconds too, which just doesn't happen apparently. If we can get past the point of getting the, the, the dummies done on here, and then move on to the dummies over here, Rosario's burst might be able to hit over here. Alright, so... I don't think it's going to read. Oh, you jumped forward! Why would you jump forward? <laughs> Uh, now let's go restore energy again. Yay! Hello, lady. I want a polearm music and throw their polearm. But that's a, that's a normal thing. Like that's part like part of what spears were made for, right? It was made to be thrown. And why don't we have a polearm music that can throw their spear? Okay. So apparently, step back. 
Yeah, she jumps very far. Yeah, it's it's same thing as Toma's. It's like only half as far as you need to go. I even yeah, even the side ones over there, I don't think are gonna reach. I don't think it's doable. Yeah, I can't fathom Rosaria's versus one. It's not gonna reach over here. Um, like, like here, I'll, I'll I'll show you right. So if we perfectly place it where the range manages to to curve and hit the the back one, we might be able to get to round three. But then what after round three, right? Like John Ling's burst is not gonna reach over here. It's not gonna reach over here. Tomo's burst, I don't think, is gonna reach over here either. Like, what do we do after round three? Rely on the lightning at that point. Right here, about. And again, this dude has to talk for five years. So just, but still, it wastes a lot of the duration. <laughs> oh, okay. It literally, so clearly that was too close. It killed, it hit the red like immediately before. Like if I perfectly place the burst, it might clear it. And as soon as it starts spawning over here, right, what do we do? Because we won't have Rosari's burst anymore for over there. Toma's burst we already established is not going to reach. Sean Ling's burst is not going to reach. Like... On top of the difficulty of placing it, oh, I forgot that it starts on the right side. So I'd have, I'd have to place it to the right. Let's use Zarya's burst to the right slightly, but not too far right because I need to hit the two blues that spawn in the middle after that. And I don't even know what spawns after that. So like, and, and Toma's burst here, like, I'm pretty sure they're. Oh, really? Seriously? I did not step out. I was, I was not. Chefe, I want to punch you in your freaking face. I did not step out there. Screw you. All I wanted to do was test stepping in the freaking corner. I just want to stand in the corner and see what the like range of Tremos burst would be. Again, this is one of those things that's theoretically, with lightning, theoretically is possible, I think. Like, if we have perfect lightning placements, perfect Rosario burst placement, if Jean, if we can somehow perfectly stand in the corner without somehow triggering Tepe to make pull me out of it even though I didn't step on the freaking box the theoretically maybe it's like so many maybes but it requires like perfect lightning RNG perfect placement of a burst and then even on top of that I still don't think I'd have the range to deal with anything on these other two while also like, like again theoretically with lightning I don't I don't know yeah I'm not gonna I'm not gonna wait <laughs> I'm not gonna wait 80 days for Zhongli to try to do this with Zhongli. Guoba, sorry, I'll try putting it right here this time. Give me like half a second longer. At most, Guoba might be able to hit one. Might. And he didn't even hit it there. See? So, oops. Yeah, it doesn't last long enough. Well, um, I think I'm out of ideas, and I, I, I don't see this as feasible again. Like, not without absurd lightning RNG, at least. Yeah, yeah. Theoretically, the lightning might be able to hit them in for like a one in a billion chance. Like, it's just stupid. We're not doing that. So, uh, although lightning, the guarantee, the chance of lightning hitting me twenty times in a row is about a hundred percent. Use catalyst. There's some suffering. No. Uh, I also don't think I have anyone other than Barbara. Right, so, really, I jumped. I jumped, Tepe. This, you, I jumped. Ah, uh, okay. Just, just. I jumped, like, what is wrong with you, Tepe? You didn't hear that.
Well, there you have it. I told you our latest recruit is pretty strong. Wow, we did it. Frick off, I don't want to talk to any of you. You all deserve to die. I want Raiden Shogun to win. Everyone's visions should be taken. I hate all of you. No, oh, get out of here. The only reason I was miserable was because of Tepe being a total butthole. Like, like the square, like the, the jumping, and the not being out of the square, and him being like, <laughs> Oh, Tepe, you deserve all misfortune that comes to you. Literally all, all the misfortune. In that case, why don't we make this more... Build that to us part. Now we're married to Senora now. And we're fighting to be out of the marriage. I really like to do this without food as well. Let's warm up at the crystal here. And wait for some bugs to spawn. I'm just going to try to DPS her down before she, you know, can leech all my health away with the, the pyro stuff going on. Basically just going to Toma Shield and then Jow Burst. Alright, and as long as she doesn't go invulnerable in her tornado state, I think we got it. Ah, crap. Not good, not good. Oh, of course you tornado. Oh. <laughs> Alright, we got it. Not too bad. Would have been much more difficult if we didn't have Zhao doing, you know, decent damage. Completely vaporized. Very nice. Bye bye. Can we use the ball? No. <laughs> I wanted to see if I could throw the ball at her. Look at that damage buff going. 26k. Are we hit 30k? No, we're not gonna hit 30k. Ow. Why aren't you dead yet? Oh, there we go. Okay. Alright, claim AR45. Yay! Primo gems and whatever crystals and more fragile resin. So we're gonna have 64 for tomorrow. That's very nice. And we're gonna get a total of two more wishes. Woo! <laughs> well, these <laughs> Alien Trail just got like <laughs> slingshot to the wall. Uh, poor dude. Oh, that should work. That should work. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Good, we one cycled it. Yay! A bow that will change my life. Yay! Sweet. Amazing. Thank you all for joining. Bye-bye. Fun stream. Screw Tappy. <laughs>